Hi guys, here I bring you a great update on the uncopy lock to steal a brain rot. The link is on comments for you. I was trying to configure the admin commands to spawn things and such but I couldn't, but in this video I will teach you how to edit things like rarity, mutations and spawn percentages. Here you will find everything about the administrator commands, they are even created. However I could not synchronize my Roblox profile to give me permissions and that you can also. However if you also want to try it here is where it is to edit. As you can see these are the commands. But anyway, I'll move on to the next things there are. In the next video I'll try to bring a definitive tutorial on how to configure the commands or even a new update. If you see that I don't comment well on the things that happen on screen or what I'm showing, it's because my video editor doesn't allow me to visualize well what I'm doing. As you can see, the HD admin is already included just for the owner for things like flying, banning, etc. What you're seeing is a percentage configuration so that only good things appear. Something you can also edit. I'll show you how shortly. We will look for the following section within Roblox Studio to be able to edit things like rarities, mutations, percentages, add things and add tools. I will stop commenting because of the problem with my editor. So pay close attention to what's happening on the screen and how I edit it. It's not that complicated because everything is divided into sections and with their respective names. Here I am changing the chances of secrets appearing to 60% so that many more appear as you will see below. As you can see, many more secrets than usual are appearing here, and so you can change it with all the rarities to your liking. Keep in mind that in the end all the percentages must add up to 100%. Now I will return the percentages to their default values. Here you can edit everything about the rebirths, what brain rot needs to be reborn and how much money you need. Here I will show you what the default money is and how much I will edit it. For example, I'm on rebirth 2, so I'll change how much money I need to be reborn to 25 to test. You can do this with all rebirths and later edit the tools it will provide you. As you can see, this works perfectly. Remember that you can change all of this in the configuration path I showed a while ago. Here you can edit. Add and modify existing brain rots, things like how much they cost, how much money they give are edited here, and these are all the brain rots that exist so far. Here you will find all the tools and weapons in your game. Here you can set whether it is given to you for free upon entering or whether you have to buy it, or assign a specific rebirth to obtain it. This is the basics that you can edit. As I said in the next video I will bring the tutorial and the complete configuration about the administrator commands for things like spawn brain rots, spawn brain rot but on all servers, and more things that these commands bring, in the same way as I said I showed where the script is so that you can try to edit and configure this on your own, for everything else the game is fully functional and ready to use. In the comments you can ask for new uncopy locked or any questions you have. Otherwise, thanks for watching this video, if you want to support me give me a like and subscribe to me to get new uncopy locks and new updates on the ones I've already uploaded, as I said at the beginning the link is in the comments, see you later.